I have so many emotions and none of them are welcome. SFPD! Uh... Meow? You've already heard it by now. The trailer for the live-action CGI hybrid Sonic the Hedgehog movie is out. Also, they are making a Sonic the Hedgehog movie for theaters in 2019. Also, Sonic the Hedgehog is still a big name to be made into a movie in 2019, apparently. First things first, I'm a fan of the character and the games, and a lot of other stuff, even when they're bad or haven't aged well. I like Sonic the Hedgehog so much that I think the franchise matters to the history of video games and popular fiction in general. It's full of unique science fiction and fantasy concepts to be notable, even though it's a series about cartoon animals. The movie so far? I have no idea what they're going for. The character design for Sonic is not really that great. Oh, it's not because it's different from any design from the games or shows, but it's because someone at Paramount overthought the concept. The decision to make the character fit into a real world setting visually isn't jiving with me. After things like Sonic Adventure, Sonic 06, and Sonic X, I thought this would be obvious to anybody by now. I think you can make it work story-wise, but this doesn't seem to be working in the film's favor. There are fun moments in the trailer. Sonic using the rings as magic portals, something the games like to do from time to time, and slowing down time around Sonic are fun concepts that capture the zany and fun-loving vibe of the character well enough. He does say that he is a hero to an extent. Basically, it looks like I'm gonna have to save your planet. We have no choice. Jim Carrey's Dr. Robotnik Eggman character could make or break this movie. I was going to assume that they would put him in a suit similar to his Grinch role, but hey. no! Nope. I'm wrong. I guess we'll have to wait an entire movie to get the Mad Doctor we know and love. He's also an entertaining part of the trailer. Eggman is almost never portrayed as a villain that's not serious all the time, so it works. The design choices befuddle me because we live in an age where films based on comic books translate the weird visuals and odd characters to the big screen perfectly. It could be animation, it could be live action, it could be whatever. Why do we still struggle with video game to film adaptations? That's a question that doesn't seem immediately clear. At least, not yet. I guess if the trailer gave me one thing, it's that it got me to listen to Coolio's Gangsta's Paradise finally. But I don't think this movie will be anything like Dangerous Minds though. Look at this! I took 9 million steps today! I'm split. It's too ugly to truly judge how the film is going to be, but I don't think that Sonic exists solely as a marketing gimmick or cash grab product. Yes, the character in first game was created to make the Sega Genesis compete better against Nintendo's games. Why can't it be more like that nice boy Mario? Oh! Little brat! But throughout the character's history, there is something that makes people interested and makes them work to make a very human product. From going fast, to slowing down to be more introspective about certain themes, characters, and subject matter. With developers, creators, and fans in Japan, Europe, America, and all over the world, there is something that sticks with Sonic that is genuine. Even though most of the time it comes out cringy or underdeveloped or shadowed by the demands of the business side of things. This Sonic the Hedgehog movie might at least have the bare minimum of this idea. Ben Schwartz, the actor who voices Sonic in the film, was on Larry King Now this past year talking about the appeal for the character. Okay, what's Sonic the Hedgehog? Sonic the Hedgehog is based off of a video game from 1991, and it's about this, this hedgehog that can run really, really fast. And as a kid, it's like one of the most iconic video games of all time. Look, I don't expect this film to be a highlight of the series or for the brand itself, but if some fans find value in the film, then it's okay by me. I'll be keeping a tab on this one. Is that all you got? No, but thank you for asking.